Fox 12 is your school authority. And if you've had trouble finding child care in the past, you are not alone. Most Oregonians have been living in what's known as a child care desert. With the pandemic, many school-aged kids suddenly needing care as well. Fox 12's Haley Rush wanted to revisit the issue and see if anything has changed. A child care desert means quality, affordable care is not available for many families. So I spoke with a child care expert who tells us what it's looking like out there right now. I think there's just been the great, this real shift around one, we didn't used to need school aged care for children who were enrolled in public school between eight and four. Like that wasn't a market we had before. Rin Johns is the founder of PDX Waitlist, a service that helps parents find child care as well as helps providers manage their wait lists. She started the business after not being able to find child care for her own kid when she needed it. But with COVID-19, John says a lot of parents still have their kids out of daycare. Because of that, she says you should be able to get a child in somewhere pretty quickly it may not be your first choice, but she says it could be your second or third. She says some parents have switched over to a nanny because they feel it's safer. She also says with school-aged kids now staying home, families are hiring nannies for them too. I think because so many folks need some kind of care, and that is relatively easy to set up, um, that is just a super in-demand group and has become very, I mean, it was already expensive. It's already been sort of a luxury um, child care offering, but it's been bit up. Uh, even more as folks are more desperate. When life does go back to normal and parents go back into work, Johns believes there will be a huge issue when it comes to finding care. She says we were already in a child care desert before the pandemic and now many providers have shut down that might not open back up. I did ask Johns if she's seen child care become more affordable since the demand is lower. She says actually, unfortunately, the opposite has happened. In child care facilities, many of them have had to raise their prices to stay in business during this time. Haley Rush, Fox 12 Oregon.